we saw this morning was a different kind of evil. I'm angry. Uh, I'm ashamed. What happened this morning was a mass murder. Now I got to look over there and not see him say, hi, Miss Vicky. <laughs> How's your day going? This senseless terror has no place in our community. Seems like every year it progresses. Something gets to the point where it devastates our community. I myself am heartbroken. Enough is enough. Justice will be done. Two major stories impacting us tonight. Indianapolis experiencing its first mass murder in over a decade. And a winter weather advisory goes into effect in just a few hours as freezing rain and snow move into central Indiana during the morning hours. We will have all the timing for you in about five minutes. But first, a horrific murder and tragedy. Six people killed in a near northeast side home. We just learned the names of the victims. They include an unborn child, a 13 year old, an 18 and 19 year old and two adults. A 17 year old was wounded and found less than a block away telling police they killed my family. Mayor Joe Hogsett and IMPD Chief Randall Taylor are outraged. A family is heartbroken and a community is shaken by bloodshed not seen in Indy in a decade and a half. Now we have team coverage following the story from every angle. We begin with CBS 4's Russ McQuaid, who has the very latest on the investigation and what city leaders are saying tonight.